In this video, we're going to look at what to do with past screening lists that need to be migrated. Now in your past screening lists, you have been asked to supply the shelf number for the resource that you would like to screen in class. In this example, the film that we're looking at is Notorious by director Alfred Hitchcock. The shelf number is BRD1942. The shelf number is the unique identifier for the resource. So in this case, it's a Blu-ray disc with the identifier 1942. In Sophia, the record keeps this unique identifier. It is converted to the call number. If we go to the bottom of the record, where we can verify the availability of this edition at Concordia University Library, we can see the same information, BRD1942, as a call number. You will notice that there is a fifth digit that has been added in the migration. This is to plan for the collection is going to keep growing in the coming years. Therefore, we ask you to type in your call number, your past call number, but just add one zero in front of the past call number. So let's take a closer look at what this is. For example, if I'm looking for a DVD and my call number was 7899, I simply add after the DVD a zero and then 7899. This will give me the result for the film that I'm looking for. If my call number has zeros preceding it, I'm going to maintain these zeros and add another one. So for example, my call number was 0009. I'm going to now have four zeros. So 0, 0, 0, 0, 9. And my result. If I don't add this number, it is possible that normally it will not retrieve the right record or the record that we want. So for example, here, there are no results if I haven't added this call number, this zero in front of the call number.